Okay, hello there, and welcome to part three of my vintage home brew. Um, if you haven't seen parts one and two, you may want to take a look at them to catch up. But basically, what it is, um, I've made some home brew, some wine, and some beer, and I've stuck it in the shed in the garden, and it's been there for 19 years. Um, and I'm going to open the bottles today. Um, I've got a bottle of wine and two bottles of the beer that I've made. Um, as I say, I'm going to open them, but whether I'm going to taste them is another thing. Um, so anyway, let's go. I'll start with the wine. Um, firstly, I'll just say, with the, the beer bottles, there will be a bit of a sediment in the bottom of the bottle, because that's normal with home brew. Um, but with the wine, um, there's no sediment at all, because when I bottled them, I filtered the wine. So, just put them two to one side. I'll start with the wine first. As I say, 19 years old. And this is elderflower. Let's hope the cork comes out easy enough. So, so far, so good. That's coming out okay. Actually, it doesn't smell that bad, actually. Stick some in a glass. Nice and clear. Don't know about tasting it, but it smells okay. It doesn't smell too bad, actually. You can see. Well, I hope you can see. It's very clear. There's no, no sediment in it at all. Tastes a bit bitter. Mm. Yeah, a bit, bit soury. Right, that's the wine. Now for a bottle of beer. These will be two uh, bitters that I made. Oh, there's no fizz. And the top's been taken off anyway. Ugh, looks bloody awful. Doesn't smell very well. So. Smells a bit vinegary, so I'm not going to bother with that. Actually, it looks, it looks like red wine or rose wine. No. Forget that one. Try this one. See if this will fizz. Oh, bit of a fizz on that one. Ooh, smells worse than the first one, eh? oh, At least it doesn't look red. There's a bit of fizz on it. Doesn't look too bad. It looks like proper bitter. It's got a little head on it. It doesn't smell very nice. It smells like vinegar. No, that's it. I'm definitely not going to drink that. Anyway, that's it. That's my uh, vintage home brew. 19 year old wine and beer. Mm-hmm.